Hello, grade five. Welcome to another topic. And today we are going to talk about the perimeter of a quadrilateral. Repeat after me. Perimeter of a quadrilateral. Let's have our vocabulary. So here, perimeter. Repeat after me. Perimeter. Let's spell perimeter. P E R I M E T E R. Perimeter. Length. Repeat after me. Length. Let's spell L E N G T H. Length. Plus. And then the symbol is this red plus. Let's spell P L U S. Plus. Centimeter. Repeat after me. Centimeter. And then it's denoted by C N M. Let's spell C E N T I M E T E R. C M centimeter. Meter. Repeat after me. Meter. And it's denoted by the symbol M. Let's spell M E T E R. M meter. Okay, so now let's review our previous topic on quadrilaterals. So, quadrilaterals have four sides and they also have four angles. One, two, three, four. Four sides. One, two, three, four. Four sides. One, two, three, four. Four sides. One, two, three, four. Four angles. One, two, three, four. Four angles. One, two, three, four. Four angles. Okay, so remember our squares. What type of quadrilateral is it? It's a square. Rectangles. Okay. What type of quadrilateral is it? It's a rectangle. And then we have our rhombuses. What type of quadrilateral is it? It's a rhombus. And we have our parallelograms. What type of quadrilateral is it? It's a parallelogram. Trapeziums. What type of quadrilateral is it? It's a trapezium. And then lastly, we have our kites. What type of quadrilateral is it? It's a kite. Okay, now let's go to our perimeter. So the perimeter of a quadrilateral is the sum of the lengths of all four sides of the quadrilateral. So perimeter is equal to the sum of all the sides. So side A, side B, side C, side D. So here we have perimeter equals to A plus B plus C plus D. So let's put some measurements. So for A, we have 5 centimeters, B, 4 centimeters, C, 6 centimeters, and D, 7 centimeters. Let's put that in our equation. So 
let's add all of them. 5 centimeters plus 4 centimeters plus 6 centimeters plus 7 centimeters equals 22 centimeters. So let's answer the question. What is the perimeter of the quadrilateral? The perimeter is 22 centimeters. Easy, right? You just add everything. Add the sides. Okay, let's practice. Okay, I'm going to give you 20 seconds to answer this activity. So I will set the time. So this exercise is called find the perimeter. I will read the question. I will state the um, choices. And after that, I will set, I will start this, the time and you will, after the time is up, you will have, uh, you will answer. Okay, ready? Let's answer. Go. What is the perimeter of the quadrilateral? A, 40 meters, B, 42 meters, C, 44 meters, and D, 46 meters. Your time starts now. Tick tock, tick tock. Okay, time is up. And the answer is 42 meters. Why 42? Because this is 12. And this is 12. And this is 9. This is also 9. So you just add everything. 12 plus 12 plus 9 plus 9 equals 42 meters. The perimeter is 42 meters you got it okay good next find the perimeter what is the perimeter of the quadrilateral a 28 centimeters b 29 centimeters c 30 centimeters d 32 centimeters time starts now Okay, the time is up and the answer is D, 32 centimeters. Why? Because 8 plus 8 centimeters plus 8 plus 8 equals 32. The perimeter is 32 centimeters. Okay, find the perimeter. What is the perimeter of the quadrilateral? A, 30 centimeters, B, 32 centimeters, C, 34 centimeters, D, 32, 36 centimeters. Time starts now. Think. Okay, time is up and the answer is 34 centimeters. Why? Because this is 7 centimeters. This is also 7 centimeters, 10 centimeters, and 10 centimeters. And you add all of them up, so the answer is 34 centimeters. The perimeter is 34 centimeters. Okay, find the perimeter. 
What is the perimeter of the quadrilateral? A, 62 meters, B, 64 meters, C, 66 meters, or D, 68 meters. Your time starts now. Okay, the time is up. The answer is 62 meters. Because this is 16 meters, this is also 16, 15, and 15. You add all of them, and the answer is 62 meters. The perimeter is 62 meters. Next. What is the perimeter of the quadrilateral? Okay, 62 centimeters, B, 64 centimeters, C, 66 centimeters, or D, 68 centimeters. Go. Okay, time is up. The answer is 68. Why? Because this is, this side here is just equal to this side. So 17 plus 20 plus 17 plus 14 centimeters equals 68 centimeters. The perimeter is 68 centimeters. So did you get everything correct? Okay. Easy, right? You just add all the sides and you will get the perimeter. So good job. Congratulations. You did a very good job. And thank you. And goodbye. And stay safe.